First, Republican lawmakers are asking the state Supreme Court to block the state's safer at home order. It was, of course, extended by Democratic Governor Tony Evers until May 26th. Fox 6's Bill Miston joins us now. And, Bill, Republicans are asking for the state Supreme Court to take this case with the hope of getting a ruling sooner. Sidestepping the lower courts last week, Governor Tony Evers extending the safer at home order until next month because of the pandemic, which has killed hundreds in the state and tens of thousands nationwide. But Republican leaders calling the governor's extension an unprecedented overreach. Without a vaccine, state health experts and state leaders saying social distancing and the safer at home order, the only tools available to keep COVID-19 at bay until widespread testing is in place. Wisconsin was projected to have between 440 and 1,500 deaths from COVID-19 by April 8th. Last Thursday, Governor Tony Evers ordering Department of Health Services Secretary Andrea Palm to extend that order, closing non-essential businesses until May 26th. Republicans suing Palm Tuesday and two other DHS executives in the conservative-controlled state Supreme Court, arguing the extension exceeds DHS's authority. Assembly Speaker Robin Voss and Senate Majority Leader Scott Fitzgerald saying there's immense frustration regarding the extension as it goes beyond the executive branch's statutory powers. In response to the suit, Governor Evers saying today legislative Republicans told the 4,600 people in the state of Wisconsin who have contracted COVID-19 and the families of the more than 200 people who have died, we don't care about you, we care about our political power. This week, Evers announcing a phased plan to reopen the state based on public health benchmarks released by the White House last week. More than 4,700 people in the state are confirmed to have the disease, with a majority of the cases impacting southeastern and central Wisconsin. Northeastern Wisconsin also seeing a recent rise in cases. Health officials have warned a quick reopening could lead to another outbreak. Now, the state has until the end of next week to file a brief in response to that suit. A ruling could come as early as at the end of the month. Ben? Another big decision for the state Supreme Court, it looks like. Bill Miston, thank you.